Hey there guys, welcome back. This is Necro. Recently I have bought a new phone as my old Poco F1 Touch got damaged and it was ghost touching and not responding perfectly. So I have exchanged my old phone and I have bought Ico 9 SE as it was budget friendly. Everything was perfect and performance and gaming were top notch. And also facilities provider for gaming were too good. Except this one feature, whenever I play a game, like PUBG during important phase, if I get a call, then it's over guys. It takes me to a new color screen and interrupt my gaming experience. This happens every time whenever someone call me and there is no related feature to suppress calls or show the caller ID on top of the screen or something which doesn't interrupt my gaming experience. After a lot of research, I have found that IQ7 has a cool background call and auto reject feature in ultra game mode, which is missing in IQ9 SC because IQ7 has the stock IQ dialer and IQ9 SC has the Google dialer. So I have come up with a solution. Recently, I have watched the YouTube video. The YouTuber provided Vivo stock dialer APK and it's same as the IQ7 dialer obviously and it's not interrupting while gaming and showing the caller ID silently. It's super perfect. Link for the video in the description and I'm not taking any credit for the app links guys. Please don't spread hate. So coming to the solution, get ready with a PC and in your PC, download the stock dialer folder from the link in the description and download the IQ's ADB and Fastboot folder. Now first open the ADB folder and there will be four files in it. Just copy them in the file path, C drive slash windows slash system 32. Just paste it there and also paste those files in C drive slash windows slash syswow64. Then right click on this PC and click on properties and click on advanced system settings and a small dialog box will appear. There click on environment variables. There you can see two boxes in the first box. Uh, double click on the path and a new dialog box will be opened and there click on the new and copy the file path name just now the file path where you have pasted the file one is the system32 file path name uh, you can either copy and paste it just like i did or you can just type it manually whatever are you seeing on your screen right now click on new and then copy or paste the other file name which is syswav64 or just manually type it and then press OK. Then downside, you can see a system variables box. Uh, there you can see the path again. Just double click on that and repeat the same process as before. One is the system32 file path name. Uh, you can either copy and paste it just like I did or you can just type it manually whatever are you seeing on your screen right now. Copy or paste the other file name which is syswav64 or just manually type it and then press OK. After this, close the dialog box, right click on the windows icon and click run. There type CMD and press enter. Command prompt will open, just hold on and now head over to your phone, go to the settings, go to system and find developer options. If there is no developer options, then go to your about phone, software information and tap on the bill number seven times. It will automatically unlock the developer options for you and in developer options, find USB debugging and turn it on. Now take a USB cable and connect your phone to your PC and in your phone there will be a message shown up. Uh, just press allow and in the PC command prompt type ADB devices. It will show daemon is running successfully and now disconnect your phone, connect again and type ADB devices. It will show something like this. Now open the stock dialer folder and in that first folder you can find install loop.batch file. Just run it. And if it tell uh, insert a new phone, then just disconnect your phone guys, nothing to worry about and then connect the USB again, it will be fine for you. It will automatically install all the required apps for you. Just disconnect your phone uh, after that and simply disable Google dialer and Google contacts in the settings. Now for the final step, go to settings, go to apps and find the phone management app and tap on it and allow all the permissions which are required. Now, boom guys, uh, your dialer has changed a new UI, a new features. Uh, whenever there will be a call, it will not interrupt your gaming experience for sure. And another surprise for you, when you open the game, you can see two new features features in your game sidebar that is uh, background call and auto reject feature uh, in your iq9 sc guys i guess even i couldn't expect this kind of solution i hope you like the video guys thank you guys subscribe me and stay tuned for more videos